Hello and welcome back to Overcooked. Let's keep going. We're up to 4-6. I think I just saw... No, I thought it was 420 was the 3 star high score. We've got to get 320, not 420. Uh, <laughs> I'm already so confused with all we have to do. But we're doing burritos. The trick is the rice is on, you know, as with the most um, overcooked maps, the ingredients are on the opposite side of what you have to do with them. So, we also need some steak. Actually, steak is pretty easy. We can get that chopping. Why? Oh, there's fires in this map as well. It's asking us to um, get the fire extinguisher to... Um, need the fire extinguisher to, to put out the, the flames on the floor. This rice is... Oh, we need to... Yeah, we need to cook this. We need to cook that steak. And we also need the tacos. Or tacos, if you will. Tacos or tacos, or, or, or whichever you prefer. We almost got yeeted off just then. Okay, but now we can get the taco access. We have a conveyor belt here. This is a little... This is going to be another finicky map. But there, there we go after, like, what, one minute, our first order. We've got rice there as well. Um, already cooked, but we got to do chicken. We've got to get some chicken, so... We'll just pick it up and then the chopping board's gonna come back. Okay. Um, we've got a couple of. We have four dishes that we can work with just right off the bat, which is great. Don't even know where our other frying pan is on the other side. Okay. We can actually get started on our next order, which is a mushroom order. And the mushroom's actually gonna come back around here. But the chopping board's on the other side. So. Chicken's ready though, so we can get this, get the rice, then get the, the taco. We're going to make sure we can get all of this before it... That wasn't even a correct order? Why well, wasn't that a correct order? What did we do just then? Okay, this is the one though, this is the one, so... Okay, a beef, a beef taco. <laughs> there we go, and a chicken. Let's get the chicken and the beef done. The rice is... Rice is very, uh, takes very short time to cook, so that's why we're not getting on there just yet. But let's see if we can actually aim things. There we go. So we've got... Okay, so we've got two meats going on, and that's, this is really good, this is really good, because now we can do this. Get the taco, and then get the rice, and it's perfect timing. It's chicken now, and then it's mushroom after that. So you can actually get started on the mushroom. And then you can get a plate. Get the chicken. I thought I picked up the rice. That rice isn't even cooked. That's alright. Minor inconvenience. You can prime that. Um, now, there should be a mushroom somewhere. Someone was chopping up a mushroom. But why, is, why can't I not see the mushroom? I thought I had someone start on the mushroom, but no one started on the mushroom. That's okay. Um, we're gonna go back to the other side to chop the mushroom. Oh! That was the mushroom. I think that was the mushroom. It's a little inefficient, I must admit, but it's okay. We're learning. We're still learning. We need rice to get cooked. Need some more rice. So we'll chuck the rice there. There we go. Um, now I think... Now I think the last time I played this game, Kobe was still was still around. Now he's not around, so I don't... I don't know if I can say Kobe every time I throw the ingredients over and actually land it. But it's a tribute. I, I hope if I hope if I ever do say that, it, it is seen as a tribute to Kobe and not a not an insult to to his um, legendary status as an NBA player. Okay, we need some some steak cooked. It's a little slow. It's a little slow. Get a chicken order going. 
I don't know why we, we have a stake called- Oh! Okay, because we are really far- <laughs> we are really behind. Um, there's another stake! This one is- This one is insane, this map. I don't know if I could do this one, man. Because, like, you can get someone... Like... This is insane. It's just a little insane. We need to move that out of the way so we can get the chicken as well. Um, yeah, because I don't know how the actual, um, the conveyor belts work. I, I thought they just swapped around to the other side, but it's actually... Well, like, we can't do anything. We're gonna lose some... We're gonna lose that order. We lost $30. 30, um, garlic... Or 30 onion dollars. Well, that's alright. We still get it. We still get three stars. We get two... <laughs> I, I'm glad we didn't restart, because we still got three stars there. Let's just keep going. Oh, we're back! We're back! We can get... We can head back to the kingdom. Hello. Hello, Onion King. Will you speak to... Oh, we have to go up to him. I thought I thought the cutscene cut was just going to play instantly. My chefs, you're back. However, did you get through the horde? Your squad must be giving off some seriously harmonious vibes. This is good. If they fear you, you must be almost strong enough to defeat them. Head north now, where I hear the kitchens can only be conquered by the most coordinated of crews. Move as one, my friends, and remember, keep communicating. Bark will be fish food. That isn't a nice thing to say. Good luck, I might have skipped the voice line at the very end. Apologies if I did. Let's get out of here. Alright. What's next? Another another sushi place? 5 1? We're up to 5 1. That's crazy. I thought we were like still in the threes, man. Okay. We got a joystick, dude. Yo! This is um This is like some moving out mechanics. The the game moving out. That's pretty cool. We'll keep that in mind. Now, the timer has started, unfortunately. This is a little insane. Let's just, um, work out what to do first. Yo, this is some west- eastern western fusion, man. We're gonna do burgers and... and sushi. This is cool. This is cool. I can get behind this. So we gotta assess our plates as as always. Uh, like you gotta you gotta know how many plates you have to work with. So we can do something like this, and then I'm assuming to get the serveries on the other side. And we gotta get the rice as well. So let's um let's chill. We gotta just chill, and then you gotta get started on some cucumbers. All right, now uh, let's um. This one feels pretty tricky. Pretty tricky to be efficient with as well, because I feel like our left guy doesn't have much to do. <laughs> I keep on picking up the ingredient thinking that we can just get over to the other side. And then it's just like... They're just like falling, balancing over the edge, and as they realize they don't have any ground. Actually, we should... This one... We can move this... And then just serve it like that. Okay, I think we can give it a go. I think we can give it a go. Um, we just gotta make sure... We gotta do all the chopping. We just gotta chop. We just gotta chop what we can. So two sushis. One. Two. Fish first. Now, while he's chopping... I wanted to prime both of them just so we can chop two things while we... Do that. We can even load up some rice like that. And then... That is good. This is good because that means once this is ready, we can pick up both rice. You should be chopping the cucumber. You can get both rice like that. You can even put a patty there. Move this back and now we already have two orders we can work with. So let's do the fish one first and then the cucumber one next. And then you can cut two beef. And I like this system. I like this system. Now, we've got to do a couple things here. 
Actually, this is fine. So while you're washing the dishes, you can cook this. You can put another bun here, maybe. I don't... And then you can cut another steak. Move back like this. Once you finish cutting that steak, you can do something like this. And then you move back to the next order, which is a fish and cucumber sushi. Just, we save the just in time and then you can move this back so you can serve that now we forgot to cook it we forgot to cook that patty that we moved on this side so that's all right but um okay at least we got that we need the rice for the sushi and then you can get started on the steak Okay, it's a little, it's a little tricky, a little tricky, but I think we're doing okay. Move this back. Get a dish. Serve this burger. Get this patty. Clean that dish. Move over. Move, move back. Remember to cook the patty this time. And then completely forget that we do need a plate to actually... With sushi, you do need a plate to pick up the rice and everything, so we need to remember that. Um, you can get started on cooking that. That's fine. Um, okay, so we can do this. Sushi order's getting a little cold. Apologies. But that's good, that's two orders already. That's two orders. Now, he should have washed, and this guy should have washed another dish. Actually, we're fine. We're actually fine. Um, fish. You need a chop, and then while he's chopping fish, you can cook another rice. You can cook two rice, actually, because our next two dishes are rice. Or we can always be cooking rice anyway. Um, you've got three dishes to watch, wash with, which is great. That's a bit of a tongue twister there. Oh, good, good, okay. I love how... Did we swap those? No, that definitely wasn't swapped around beforehand. So, I think we said last time we do need plates when we transport the sushi dishes. So, we remembered it this time. I think we can fit... We can, I, think, I think we can fit both these orders in. Yeah, we can. Because we remembered this time. And we need seaweed as well, let's not forget. That would have been really awkward if we got to send seaweed back. But we can send this... Send this, and bam. Let's send it. That's 565. Not bad. Not bad at all. We can eat ourselves in the water. Take a dip. Let's go. 420. That was a 420 level. No orders failed. We'll take it. We'll take it. Alright, let's, let's see if we can fit one or two more in. Depending on how well we, we do this next level. It's a sky level. There's a switch. One of the best gameplay mechanics in Overcooked 2. Finding the switch. I wanted to check if there was any interactions with the rainbow. No such interaction. Okay, 5-2. Alright, so he's on the left. We're doing... We're doing burgers. We can get two people started on burgers for now. And then once that's good, we can um, get this guy just loading up some some buns and then send it. Um, and then you can get started on chopping another steak and then you can pick up this usually i'm not a fan usually if there's like um just what do you call it you can get this this is one where like every cook just does their own order and you just stagger them i think this is one of those ones um but yeah i'm not a fan of like putting out the fires i'm like yeah, i just see it as a minor inconvenience so, like i don't even want to put it out we need cheese for this one like, because we have to get the extinguisher as well, and like, we don't even know where the extinguisher is. You can cook that. Might as well wash some dishes. Now we can get this order and serve it. You can chop some cheese, I guess. 
Okay, I guess the, now we're working on a on an order together. Need a burger for this one. Oh! He got trapped! We're both trapped! I mean, that's just unlucky. <laughs> what can we do, man? There's nothing we can do. We just have to wait out the fires. That's actually really unlucky. But they're definitely, um... Let's pick that up. It's like, I think there's a pattern to it, but like, I, it's just too much, too much brain power to work out what the pattern is. So it's just like, just cop it. I reckon. Just keep on boosting your way through. We've used up all the plate, all the free plates. So that's the tomato we've cut up. We need, oh no. The bins are like more of a inconvenience than they are like a convenience. I've never used a bin in the game. Oh, we've got to get that off. Um, that's a call. Uh, could we do that before? I don't know if we could do that before. Just get the bun and just do that on the burger while, while it's fresh on the pot. This guy just stopped cutting. He can't cut anymore. Why can't you? Okay, because he, fin he finished cutting it. I, I didn't realize he finished cutting it. No, let me out. No, you blocked off the thing. <laughs> okay, I mean, if it's to... We'll put out the fire if, like, if we have to get an order in, you know? Like, otherwise, it's like... It's not worth the effort. Okay. This is a... Healthy burger. This is a grilled burger. Not a not a Macca's burger, because it's, it's got all the healthy stuff in it. I mean, you can get that stuff at Macca's as well, I guess, but, you know, it's not the same. Need a bun. We can come around and pick up everything. So after you finish chopping, you can um, just, you know, do another burger. We're running out of time. 20 seconds. Okay, so this is actually the last order. We'll see if we can fit in another one. We might be able to. Yeah, I think we can because it's just a regular... It's just a regular one. We need to get access to the... No, the fire was a bit too annoying, but 420 I think was the goal. 300 was the goal, we smashed it. Okay. That means we can... Ooh! Eagly! It's Eagly from Peacemaker. Wait, let's change our chef to Eagly. Let's get, let's get this boy. Change, change chef? Let's get eagerly, man. Where's this boy? Let's go. Okay, 5-3. Last one. What is this? Did you see that preview? <laughs> okay, remote. Okay. So... <laughs> we need, um... One person is just gonna be the remote person, honestly. And then one person just... Okay, that's pretty... I just wanted to see how... What the give was in terms of... This is a little insane. This is a little insane. <laughs> this is fun. This is a fun one. I can imagine this one being pretty... Chaotic. Actually, one thing I'm checking, so where we can control it, but once we switch and then switch back, we actually can't control it again once we press X. So that's uh, something to keep in mind. Get a taco. Okay, there we go, that's our first order. I think in a two-player, it's probably the best we can do. I think we can only do one order at a time with two-player, because, like, we can't move around. I guess even with, like, multiple people, you still have to, like... You, you have one person controlling it, and then you have, like, the three people there just chopping. Okay. But while that's cooking, actually, 
we can do a lot more while that's cooking. So that's good intel. I, I wanted to actually gather all the plates while that's cooking. And it's all burgers. I think they're only... Oh, no, they're tacos. Okay, so let's try it again. So let's, let's get the chicken. Last time. Okay, I just need to remember one person. One person on the controls. One person collecting ingredients. Okay, so... Move. Okay, you get the chicken. And then swap back. You chop. So nothing we can do here. This is the fastest we can go while you're cooking. While you're chopping. And then... We do that. And now here, this is where we go crazy. Get all the dishes. Get all the dishes. Get all the dishes. No, we need rice. We need rice though. That's all right. That's all right. We got our rice here. We got our rice here. And then move up for the tacos. Get this plate here though. Don't forget. And then we send it. Oh, we've got to do dishes here in this map as well. Okay, steak now. Steak. Hang on. Hang on. We can increase our productivity. We can increase it. If we get two ingredients. And then do this. Who needs one person just staying on... That's crazy. This is pretty crazy. And then we can do some team shopping like that. Increase the speed. And then like do something like this. Hang on. I think we've worked out the system. We've worked out an even better system, man. That's two for one. While well, that's cooking, get the tacos. This is the easiest we're gonna get. We're gonna have it though. Because we gotta like... um. We gotta do the thing oh we gotta wash dishes as well so it's gonna be a little trickier afterwards but that's like that's two orders knocked out back to back that's a little insane make sure we do it in the correct order yeah the dishwashing is gonna be a little tricky but while you're washing dishes we can gather the next ingredients which is two mushrooms, so that actually works out for us. Go back to chopping. Cut mushrooms. Cut mushrooms. Now, mushrooms have to be fried. So while they're fried, we get the rice. A little um, behind schedule just because we found out the best way to do it a little later. But hopefully we don't lose out on... We don't get money deducted. If not the first one, we probably will lose it on the next one. Okay. That's alright, we're not gonna... Where the fuck? The fire... No, we we okay. Okay, we've, we've got it, we've got it. Okay, last last attempt. We only need to make 200, so it's not even a lot. Okay. This. This. Send it. Start chopping. Start chopping. Pick that up. Send it. Cook that. Cook that. Move over to the rice. Cook that. Cook that. Now we need to retrieve two plates. So. And two tacos as well. And then we need to make it back in time. Insane. Insane timing. And then to the rice. <laughs> no way. No way, we did it. We did it. Okay. That's perfect. That's perfect. Now, that's two orders. That's pretty much two orders. Okay, so you... No, no. I can put you back here. That's a little... Almost lost it there. That's good. This is good. This is good. Put the plate here as well. Okay, let's go back. This one's chicken and mushroom. So, mushroom. 
and a chicken. Move over here to the very corner so we can retrieve the plate there. Okay, it's not bad. This is not bad. We almost got 200. We almost got 200 as well. What? So it's really just about not... This map is really just about not setting things on fire, I think. I mean, as long as nothing sets on fire, you're bound to get the... The 200. Gotta be a little clutch if you want to be efficient, though. But this... There's, there's no... This one, we're not even in a rush, man. Look at this. Oh, we're so ready this time. Okay. Now, send that here. So, it's chicken first. The taco! We'll get our three star anyway. That's a little sad. Messed up the order. You want to get some points deducted, but that's not going to be enough to actually, um... This is fine, because we can actually, after we load them up, instantly do that. So we are going to... 30 points deducted isn't a big deal. Almost got like an insane high score, though. So we get them both cooking. We are going to... Nothing we can do about that left order. Move you back here. Chicken. Mushroom. Actually, if we don't do that mushroom order, our points are going to be really deducted. So we've got to make sure we at least get a couple more orders in. But this is actually a really fun one. This is a fun map. Move back here. Swap. Just do it, just, just do it like... Oh, okay, we, so that was the money deducted from not finishing the order in time, but this is fine. Um, let's do the mushroom order first, and then the chicken order. Yeah, we, we have so many points. This, we're gonna we're gonna get two more orders deducted. But that's still gonna bring us over 200, way over 200. There was like so many failed orders, but I think because of how efficiently we actually did the the whole run. We, we made back a lot of the money we lost. So that's... This map's all... It's just about the... Loss mitigation. How many... 93 ordered powers. It's not, it's not even a lot of failed orders. But there we go. There we go. Got a nice... um. What, what level is next here? Stone Age. Oh, it's the Harry Potter level. Okay. Uh, that'll be fun, but I'll leave that for next time. If you did enjoy um, this, this game and play, this, this, these, these few levels, if you had a good time, you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, keep in touch, and I'll see you very soon. Peace.